All right, so we had a lot of worthy opponents for this week's MVP bobblehead, but there was one quarterback whose stat line was so ridiculous, it just could not be ignored. Shundarian Ward was a little banged up last week against Waxahachie, but it did not prevent him from putting up unbelievable numbers. Ward threw for 451 yards and five touchdowns, and he also ran for 100 more yards and another touchdown in the Eagles' 59-47 victory. But what was most impressive for Ward, he only threw three incompletions out of 36 passes thrown on the night. A truly incredible performance that earned Shundarian Ward our MVP bobblehead. Wow, that was impressive and Shandarian joins us now with the Soto's associate head coach Brandon Harrison all right man what do you think of the bobblehead here now it's nice it's oh, nice that's a pretty good one for the mantle at home I'd say I'm still waiting for mine all right 36 passes three incompletions that's ridiculous 33 of 36 you almost never hear of that what was the key to being so accurate in that game uh, the week before just working on my feet making sure everything was good with my mechanics and all that and just making sure I was making the right reason, the right plays at the right time. And your receivers, man, I mean, they look good. I mean, th once again, you just watch DeSoto's offense. That's got to be really helpful for a quarterback, right? Oh, yes, sir. We got five great receivers, five great D1 receivers that can go anywhere. And we all play together as one team. Yeah, no doubt that helps. Brandon, I want to know what your confidence level is as a coaching staff in this guy right now. You see what he's doing on a week-to-week -week basis you have to believe in this guy every time he has the ball in his Oh, yeah, he, he's a program kid. He's been in the program since the seventh grade. He was able to see, you know, Dez White, um, Sean Robinson. So he, he has a foundation of what DeSoto quarterbacks are. I want to know what it's like for you, man, to be ready to go against what they're calling the District of Doom, right? Everybody's talking about this tough opponent. You guys have a tough opponent every single week, it feels like. But DeSoto, I know, is, is not going to back down from any challenge. What's that like as a player? Uh, it's just preparing. We all prepare like we want to win a championship. We all have setbacks, and we got to just come through with the, whatever we got to do. Yeah, Brandon, and for you guys, I mean, I know there's been a change. You're one of the guys left over from the previous staff. Yes, sir. New head coach, Mike Robinson. What's it been like with this change, and what have you seen in this first it's year? It's been a great transition for the kids. It's been a great transition for me. Uh, Mike has come in with a lot of energy. The kids are buying in, so we're just going to just play DeSoto football from here on out. And you got a quarterback who's making plays. It's been fun to watch you guys so far. Good luck the rest of the way. Congratulations Thank you. Thank on you being so our much. bobblehead winner.